Storm Team 4 now, despite, yeah, we saw some snow bursts. Mm -hmm. Spring is in the air. Yeah, and that thought has many of us getting ready to grow our lawns and our gardens. Meteorologist Alicia Wilson has some tips for success. With spring just right around the corner and the temperatures warming up, we've got some tips to help you have the perfect lawn or garden. Rake it. Everyone wants green, beautiful grass and a garden that grows, but Henry Beck, retail manager at Miners Garden Center, says there are a few things you should know before you put that green thumb to use. But the biggest thing that you do right now when the grass is dry is to go out there and rake it with a short tine rake to help uh, open it up and let oxygen to the roots of the grass. Henry also recommends adding an organic additive like Morganite to your soil to enhance the rich green color of your lawn. And if you're planning on seeding your lawn, never put down seed and crabgrass preventer at the same time. Crabgrass preventer will keep the seed from germinating and so you've wasted all the money that you put in seed. Along with preventing crabgrass, if you're looking on planting things like tomatoes, Henry says it's important to remember how weather works in southeast Wisconsin. Back in the days around here, there's something called the three icemen of May. It's an old Nordic thing, but uh, it pretty much holds true. It's normally the middle of May, and uh, once you get past that, you should be free of frost. Following these simple steps will ensure you have the perfect lawn in anticipation of spring. Alicia Wilson, today's TMJ4.